welcome to another episode of Starfield. And we will be continuing where we left off. From the last episode. Brandon, Take everything I've got to keep the low house open. Still doesn't feel like enough. Got a moment to hear about the low house? It mean a lot to me and to others. Sure. Good to know there's still some folks who can take an interest in the welfare of others. The Low House is a place where folks down on their luck can get a hot meal and a bed to sleep in. More importantly, they can do it with some dignity. No need to beg or steal. Everything's given with no questions asked and no favors owed. I run the place. Have for years. But to do it, I have to rely on the kindness of others. Trying to, anyway. Look, I'll be honest with you. We get a little help from some other wealthier folks in the city. But it's barely enough. It takes credit to provide for those in need. And I'm hoping you'll be willing to contribute. If you can spare a few credits, it'll do a lot of good. Thank you. I don't know if you believe in karma, but I do. I think you just end yourself some. Awesome. Okay, but why do I need to speak to her again? If you're serious, I'm drowning in work. Philborn Agricultural Systems feeds basically everyone in the stretch. Bless the Philborn brothers. But their latest IntelliWeed shipment is late. I'm not worried yet, but getting there. Could you ask Sarah Philborn what the holdup is, very politely? We buy it at a deep, deep discount, below their costs. I know not everyone approves of Henry getting more into brewing, but I don't care. The whole family has earned my eternal thanks. Cool. This is a huge help. If there's anything you can do to speed up the wheat delivery, please do it. I'll have more work for you when you get back. Well, don't just take advantage of me, why don't you? Okay, so that side of the city. I wish it had a map of the city when you are in the city and not the map of the galaxy. Capacity? seem like the sun ever goes down on this place. I really don't understand why Weston can't rein in his brother a little. How much are we going to lose on this brewing nonsense? If you're here for Weston, he's underfoot somewhere, either here or at the factory. But please, if it's about that brewing nonsense, kindly leave. <laughs> they don't need any more encouragement. I like her hairstyle. I actually had my hair like that. Why if you used it? It's the second time only I ever cut my hair, and I was almost in that hairstyle. She's weird. Not a fan of short hair, ever you know, again. Strange way of saying hello. Yeah. It's a baby you husband's. A bit personal. 
Nothing wrong with brewing. Just check it out any bar in town. Oh, sorry. My nerves are frayed. So many people coming and going for the company. Weston, that's my husband. Well, he's never been what I'd call a dreamer or a visionary. He's a practical man, good with ledgers and numbers. His brother Henry's the creative one, but he seems to have lost interest in growing the company. And now all he wants to do is brew beer. Filburn Agricultural Systems could provide the whole of the settled systems with food, not just Aquila City. Seems those two are content to think small. Yeah, that sounds like a quite a predicament. Mm. That's for sure. Well, you didn't come here to hear me natter on. Anything else? Yeah. And try to come between Weston and his brother? They'd never allow it. Oh, I've tried to drop hints and make suggestions, but it all falls on deaf ears. I don't mean to sound ungrateful, of course. The company's healthy and Weston and I live well enough. I just, I'd like to help, you know? I'd like to be a part of things instead of feeling like I'm playing second fiddle. I suppose I should just accept my lot and try to find peace with it. Mm -hmm. Nope. Let's do what we I know, for. we're late. It's been this whole frustrating episode. Short version, the farming equipment outside the walls needs to be manually rebooted. But the guards aren't going to be able to send people to fix it for days. We're committed to helping the unfortunates on the stretch, but the Ashta are just too dangerous for us to send someone. You would do that? Yeah, if you get it rebooted, sure. I'll get the harvest going ASAP. We can get the weed to Amira quick. I'll talk with my husband, but I'm sure we could arrange payment. You'd be helping our business too, after all. Just, just be careful. Ashta are very dangerous. Awesome. Let's go kill some Ashta. You look like you're up to no good, standing there, doing nothing. Okay, let's go find a way out. Hello. Hello. You really going through with it? Is it even a soccer field? That's you nice can't catch me! Painting. Nito mosquito, mom. Nito mosquito? It means cool, mom. Oh my yeah. goodness. No, it doesn't. Okay, so I need to get out of here. How the hell do I get out of this place without falling out? Because... Oh. I keep hurting oh. myself every time. But that wasn't too bad. Is there a gate here somewhere? Must be, but anyway. Actually, I want to get that. Uh... Yes, we we will tame some Ashtar. Let's go tame some Ashtar. What the hell are you? I want one.
could have sworn I asked the robot to come with me. Maybe I didn't. It's a way in here. Give it to me. Okay. Take the scanner off. something, you know? Oh, there's a gate. Don't even think about leaving the city. Ashed out there. And they are no joke. You've been warned. Looks like we got another off-worlder. So we're gonna have a house bomb? That's what Mr. Tate is working on. We'll have to move out when construction begins. A for real house. Like the ones in the core? <laughs> it's not going to be a manor house. What? Four walls. Yeah. like we're down two crates of aluminum. No, the guard took that to reinforce the railings on the wall. I uh, have a note from Bailey here. Two crates aluminum. Signed, Bailey. Not one for paperwork, is he? You're lucky you got that much. Well, as much as I can tell, it seems in order. We look after our own. Good to see that these people work together. Mm -hmm. Kinda nice. I believe everyone deserves it. If we don't the emergency fund's empty, so please hurry. That is good, good news. Uh, what was the holdup anyway? Oh, that 
makes sense. Aren't they outside the walls? Wait. You went outside the walls, didn't you? Please, don't risk yourself like that. If anyone got hurt working for the low house. I hate to ask it, but this next errand should be safe. Easy. Everything runs on charity. And our benefactors, though kind, I think sometimes... Well, get sick of seeing me. A new face may ease up the purse strings, or at least save me some errands. Okay. <laughs> Good to see getting sick of helping you too. <laughs> so, the mayor, Elias so Cartwright, rude. has always been generous to us, but it's been a while since he's donated. Raisha Lance is a huge benefactor. Laredo Firearms has been vital for us. Both of those are routine. More polite reminders, really. The last is a long shot, probably futile. But the Trade Authority is incredibly wealthy, and they have never ever donated to us. If you could convince Duncan Lynch to give us anything, heck, a single credit even, I'd consider it a victory. Mm. Try and get them to do that? Only if you can do so without ruffling feathers. We need Cartwright and Lance. But if you can, that would be enormously helpful. Once oh, you're done with that, be... come back to me. Okay. You take care. Could help me get my persuasion a little bit higher if I get it right. Spaceship engine in the middle of nowhere. Over there. Tourist? I give him three minutes before the sky chips. So you want to come here for a half day? Full day? A half day. I talk to the chat. Nobody's allowed outside the city walls after nightfall. For their own safety. Yeah, I don't seem to be seeing any nightfall happening anytime soon. Okay. Well, Welcome let's... to Aquila City's Trade Authority. The Trade yeah, Authority yeah. looks to partner with local governments to find mutually beneficial arrangements. Well, the characters in this game have really pretty eyes. Really pretty. Um, what's going to do? No, no house. The Trade Authority has a firm policy of not getting involved in internal matters. We're neutral in all affairs of the governments of the Free Star Collective and the United Colonies. That means you don't give a shit about anybody else but yourself. The Trade Authority's image is doing quite well already. Thank you very much. I'm done discussing this matter. I wouldn't have said. Huh. Down to business, then. Not that I would buy anything from you. Maybe Emma. <laughs> Deep core spacesuit. Oh, if I'd known he's got the stuff, I would have come and bought it from him. If he does have it, I'll probably have to buy it. Yeah. No, that's not the stuff. It's not the stuff. That's what I needed. Snake oil. Lung damage, poison, radiation poisoning. Uh, 
And you have ammo. Of course you do. I think we need... We need some of this stuff. nothing but now I've got no credits I'm broke now didn't want to support you but you can see your ass ahead but anyways let's go to the next person hopefully this goes better there's not enough to do around here I'm pleased you chose to visit us today. Oh. So Amira has some help? Good. She's going to work herself into an early grave if she's not careful. Laredo Firearms prides itself in helping out all the residents of Aquila City. I'll send Justin over to deliver our monthly donation. Awesome. You are quite welcome. Is there anything else you want to talk about? Mm, not really. Thank you. Thank you for coming by. Awesome. That went well. See, can't they all go like that? That would be awesome. Okay, last one. It's up there. Stop walking, man. The finest folk in the settled systems make their home right here. Good to meet you, friend. Name's Elias Cartwright. I'm the mayor of Aquila City. Now, I've got a memory for faces, and I can't say I've seen yours around here before. I make it a point to introduce myself to everyone who passes through our fine city. As the founder himself once said, there's no substitute for a warm welcome and a friendly smile. You're more than welcome. As I'm sure you know, us folk in the Free Star Collective put great stock in human kindness and generosity of spirit. I like to think that's what sets us apart from our neighbors in the United Colonies. We don't rely on machines or bureaucracy. We rely on each other. I won't pry about what brought you here. That's all of your business and none of mine. However, I'd be more than happy to give you the scoop about the core and Midtown. I oh, know, good things. Um... What day is it? Oh, shoot, I forgot. I'll send over my usual monthly donation to Amira. She truly is a wonder. And with the building project her and Mr. Tate are planning, there may be a day when the stretch is a distant memory. I'll talk with Amira later. I didn't mean to cause any problems. Between thwarting bank robberies and helping the stretch, you have the city's thanks. Truly. Awesome. Report back to Amira. If you run into any problems in my town, you come tell me. Actually, tell the rangers. <laughs> Actually, don't tell me. I'm not interested in that shit. I just know Annie's gonna be a ranger. Okay, well, that went well, except for that other jerk. But I don't think he's ever going to give anything pretty eyes and he is a tool uh, 
very blunt, useless tool. Elias and Raisha both sent their donations. Thank you. No word from the Trade Authority. I'm sorry I even asked. I like to believe everyone is capable of empathy and compassion, but people like Duncan test my faith. Yeah, Duncan is an insufferable jerk. I didn't say that, but I'm not going to correct <laughs> you. Yeah. <laughs> Sarah Philborn gave me these credits to give to you for your help with the farm. You more than deserve it. Yeah, well, I'm glad I I'm am. glad too. I have one more thing for you to do. But I hope it's more of a reward. Sure. This is part of the Intelliwit harvest. I'd like you to deliver it to Simone Jansen and her family. I want you to see the fruits of your labors. Okay. Let's go do the delivery. I know your type. Free wheel and spaces. Amira said to expect you. This wheat ensures my family won't go to bed hungry. I, I genuinely don't know what my family would do without Amira. And uh, you, you Listen, have no idea how much husband it means. we saved. Over here in Aquila, it's humbling to see regular people just looking after us. On behalf of my family, of my daughter, bless you. I'm all for helping people that want to help themselves. Ooh, I can level up. And if people are willing to... If you can see that they're down and out, just because... Oh, I'm gonna up this. You know, and they're willing to improve themselves. Because not all people that you help want to improve themselves. They just want to live with their hands out. But if you see people that, that want to do something and they try, but they're not successful at anything, just people get into a headspace and then everything they do just doesn't work. But you can see they try. Those people I would help out any day. The other ones that you can see just want a handout can jump off a cliff if all I care. Because they are just leeches. Grab jump range. Mm, get more common and uncommon in organics. Let's craft items. Actually, this is a pretty good one. Surveying. You can now use like boost packs. Yeah. That's why it doesn't work. Alrighty. Okay, so which one are we doing now? Yeah, I don't know what to do with this. Lost, so. Let's go talk to Mr. Tate. Because I don't see date at night time happening anytime soon. Because that sun just sits there. So I'm not, I'm not sure how to go about doing that quest. Let's go find the mayor again. Oh.
work a little bit, citizen. Not a lot though. It reminds me of some place, I'm just not sure what place it is. So lot 37. The building there needs work, but it could make for a very good home. Any paperwork we need to file to clear it out? Is it zoned for commercial use? <laughs> this isn't the UC. As long as you are courteous to the neighbors, do what you like. We're still waiting on the loan from Galbank. I must warn you, ma'am, that folk in Aquila are very particular about doing business with the UC. When they see our prices... I'm sure they'll come around. As you say, I love my job. So many memories of happy homeowners building new lives. Everyone nice to meet Mr. you. Tate. I'm Mr. Tate, and you have the look of a newcomer. Welcome to Aquila City. I don't suppose you're in the market for real estate. If so, then look no further. I am, but I don't have money. In the heart of the Free Star Collective, who wouldn't? I have two properties for sale. This one here is a refurbished colonial manor in the heart of the core. I also have a more modest one bedroom in Midtown. Any interest in them? Mm. It's my favorite listing I've had in years. Spacious, in the core itself. I took great pains to get all the approvals, so the neighbors should be no problem. It's historic and spacious. Oh my, so much space. And the price is a veritable bargain. Wow. I am not surprised. As wonderful as the manor is, the current owner is asking a princely sum. But if you ever do have the credits, I will be here. Okay, so what does the other one cost then? If you are ever looking to buy property, it's an unfurnished one bedroom, lots of space. Okay. It's a very convenient location, just a block or so from Co Plaza. Are you interested? Mm, don't have the listing has been open for some time. Have a good day. Okay, so why are we not? My manor in the core has been approved by both the mayor and the historical committee. Not strictly necessary. Wait, before you go, oh, there you go, my instinct says you're a person who knows how to work with their hands, or in this case, heavy equipment. Are you familiar with mining lasers? No, of course I am. Excellent. There are so many in the stretch, living in terrible conditions. The Low House and I are working together to make cheap, affordable housing. But the land we want to build on has hard stone that needs to be cleared. Okay. I do need money, but let's get some good... Uh... And it truly is the best cause. Once you clear the land, we'll be one step closer to changing some lives for the better. Okay, let's go and take care of six rocks. Ever wonder how the Crimson Fleet seems to be able? No, it works. No wonder. Okay. Another day, another shift.
the hell do I get back up there? How do I get cool safe Thank you. I'm the best realtor in town. Marvelous. It's One step one. closer. <laughs> I can't wait to tell Miss Wolf. I know it's not much, but this is well earned. Ooh, I got money. Nice. Okay. Seems to be... Ooh, the sun seems to be setting. Finally. Okay, let's see what else we can do here around here. Last one testament. Let's go do that one quickly and see uh, if that helps the time go by. Because it is still setting and we have to wait for midnight. And I think we got the damn thing at midday. Yeah, <sighs> dude. Aquila City truly is the jewel of the Free Star Collective. Okay, so now I have to the listen core to all is this the stuff. oldest district and represents the original settlement dating back to the days of Solomon Co. The descendants of the original settlers still make their home there today. Frank's just the latest owner of the old Hersonove Manor, and he's the worst, simply the worst. But it's been a problem since the Hersonove family ran out of heirs. There's no wrong the Cartwrights have been trying to write for decades. And hence, well, I need help. Okay. He's just another slick, rude, neon corporate hack, full of himself and just awful. I mean, the core is I history disagree. itself. Cads like him don't belong here. Totally agree. I was right to talk to you about this. The last Hossanov was Sahar. Sad tale there. <sighs> By all accounts, when she lost her last grandchild around 40 years ago, well, it broke her. She packed up and just plain left the estate, built some farm far from Aquila City and the protection of its walls. It didn't take long before the Ashta overran the farm, and just like that, no more Hossanovs. A lot of folks thought the same. So I need someone to go to the old Sahar farm, brave the Ashta, and see if she left a will. I swear I'll honor her wishes. Akila owes her family that much. And if it happens to kick Mr. Big Shot out of the core, well, that'll be a bonus. Sounds like, uh, yeah, just tell me where to go. Sahar's farm is elsewhere on the planet. If you can't handle Ashta, please just don't go. I don't want this whole sordid story to have more tragedy. Be careful, and look out for yourself. You ready? somewhere that I can sleep. House of the Enlightened. Oh, am I not an Enlightened? I'm pretty sure I am.
five hours, then it's midnight, or four hours. Let's make it three hours. That should make it like what to twelve. No, that is yeah. Ten past eleven is fine enough. Good enough. At least I know how to do that now. Just sit your ass on a chair. Okay, let's go and see about this. Uh... Catch me. What? Uh, shit. I, uh, yeah? Mm hmm. So there really is a thief, I'll be damned. Skulking around a factory at Madai, nothing suspicious here. I, I won't. Oh, God. This can be happening. Oh, God, no. Security. Everyone, don't move. It was supposed to be an easy don't job. Don't anybody move. Let's see. <laughs> if it ain't the hero of Galbank. And who do we have here? Looks like you're carrying a lot of weapons for a nighttime stroll. I... I... Hell, I give up. Smart move. I got a tip something was going down tonight. Was little Annie actually right about all this? Yep. Might want to consider keeping a real badge. Oh god, no, that'll go to her head. Yep. I kind of always thought she was a pest. But now, I got her from here. Aquila City owes you again. And, uh, thank Annie for me. God, she's never gonna let us hear the end of this. <laughs> no, she's not. Alrighty. There you go. It is done. Well, I guess I can sleep until morning somewhere. Until morning. I'm gonna do some new parole. Six hours. Well, hey there. So, think you've got the taste? Did you catch the thief? Tell me it worked. 
Annie, you're supposed to be doing your homework. Mom, I have to know. You got him right, right? I knew it! Annie L. Wilcox, what did you do? I, I told you about it. You know the Laredo robberies? Well, we caught the thief. Wait, so that's real? Of course, Mom. I told you. I, um, she's telling the truth. You're not pulling my leg, right? Nope. I, oh boy. I, Annie, we'll talk more about this later. But I'm proud of you. But you've got to be careful. Yes, Mom. I'm gonna be the best ranger surveillance assistant ever. Thank you for helping my girl and anything else involved. Take this. Dude. Lord preserve me. Gotta keep him here to the ground. Me, Never know what folks get might be me. getting up to. Get Hiya. Okay, now let's see what's up time. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to do this last mission first. But maybe we can get to the location at least. Seems everybody wants to talk to me right now. Uh, don't you worry, those walls are solid. Because at least I can fly there. I actually want to get this dude to come with me. So I need an extra hand. Good day, Captain. Captain, hello. I am satisfied. Dis I have no objections. Better not. Okay, he's following me now. Okay, cool. Well, let's get over there. Yes, your eminence. Oh, I like it. Thank you for the title, You've dude. got something for me? Nope. I do not. Dust off complete. Achieving orbit now. side of this map. There we go, it's the bottom of the world. Let's uh, land over there. Let's put this bird on the ground. We were gonna have to walk there, but that's this is better. Eradicate them. China too. Personally, you would consider this victory cause for celebration. Don't celebrate just yet. thing in real life would totally freak me out. Well, let's eat her food. She's not gonna eat it again. Sealant! We want sealant. 
Ooh, she's got blister. That's what I meant to take. Plums, potatoes, and pears. There. Ooh, look at the value on that thing. She was chopping up stuff, that's for sure. Ooh, what's the case? Ah, lost all credits. Metabolic agent. She has a snazzy place over here. Yeah, we need to collect more stuff. Because <laughs> I'm running out of money. Sadly. Just gonna grab everything. Everything that I can sell. Mind to your own. What? Okay. I'm just gonna loot this place completely. Might as well because. Yeah, I am really out of money. All these credits, I need mean, to miss that. I think that's everything. Let's see what's behind the door number two. Unwise to remain hostile towards us. Yeah, it is. It Potato, never get a space helmet. That's a worker. It was a worker. I advise a hasty retreat. It will save your life. Go scan that plant because then I think I've got it hundred percent. Fifty percent. Has anyone ever told you you're the greatest explorer in the settled systems? Well, they should. I think we picked that up already before. Purple cubes. Oh, did you pick? Yes, please. There's like random. People say I need stuff. more hobbies. Writing about you. I'm gonna go Thinking sell about stuff. you. Talking about you. That's three right there. Sleep in my bed. Get your own bed. Yeah, well, let's uh let's get back to the town. Might just be able to finish this one before the 
end of this episode. Here we go. There's no places. Okay, I have to go to one of the stores. I think. Your oh, no, ship's not there. half bad. Well, I have, thank you. I guess. So, okay, let's sell. Let's sell. Yes. No. Where's that knife we had? There. 152? It's worth more than that. It said 1,200. Huh. Well, that bloody sucks. Well, might as well. At least we've got 13,000 credits already. I'm just going to sell it anyway. So let's get back to... The Crossing? Two places. Well, I'll go to the mayor first and then there. Like I said, be careful. She can fix anything. I'd rather you Even forget the whole Hasanov business rather than getting hurt. Blake Elderwell. Okay. You got it! That's wonderful! But Blake Aldwell. Well, let me think back. There was a Blake. Might be we can track him or any surviving kin down. I'll get my lawyer on this. Frank Langston's in for a rude surprise. And we can maybe yes, see a Hassano return back to the core. Cool. They helped make the Freestar Collective. If they have living heirs, well, it's more than I could have hoped for. You've more than earned this. You've done the city a great service. Thank you very much. Ooh, two and a half great. Okay, credits. Fair builders. Emily Cartwright. I used to get really grossed out by blood, but I'm used to it now. Oh, she's the assistant's assistant. <laughs> okay, well, that's all of our quest done. I suppose we could have gone and talked to the other guy and got money out of him, but. Uh... Found a note about a secret outpost in the Dead Spacer. Might be worth a read. Ooh. We okay, I won't do that.
Problem? No. Just standing in the middle of nowhere, reading my missions. No problem. But anyway, that is going to end it for this episode. And if you've been watching this far, thank you very much. Don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, smack the notification bell if you want to know when I post another video or go live again. And have a wonderful evening, afternoon, morning, wherever you are. And I will catch you in the next one. Bye.